Hey guys, another payload change. Oh man! So, uh, this semester we gotta do the hardest model, and uh, we need exact size replicas for each of the payloads, so um, I, uh, I think we uh, should use the MakerBot. Dude, no, we can't, we can't do that. It, look yeah, at this it'll thing. take it, forever. It, it's gonna cost so much crazy. money. Just, no. Then we have no. to choose I mean, build make colors. And How do you mess with all the I couldn't fit this onto any model. Oh guys, 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 guys. We got this. What's the line for? We're waiting for Colonel Daniel. Oh. How do I even begin to explain? Mr. Hart. Mr. Hart is flawless. I heard that his hair is insured for $10,000. Once someone gave him the wrong reaction wheels. Once. Oh, Mr. Hart? I heard he, like, went to Mars and actually set up Curiosity himself. He yelled at me once. It was awesome. Here we are, in the most exotic of all locations, the Astro Lab. We're here searching for one of the rarest creatures on the face of the earth, the Lieutenant Colonel Tor Nathaniel. Legend says that this creature can be spotted down here sometimes between business hours, but nobody's ever been able to get a good look at him, and nobody's certainly got any good evidence. I found this picture right here on the internet. This is what we're looking for. Maybe we'll be able to find him, I don't know. I'm only packing the bare essentials here, some checks Mix and an orange. We're going in. Come on. I stopped in to visit some of the locals. They could give me some information on the Lieutenant Colonel. Unfortunately, they could only point me to more trouble. We're about to go searching in one of the most remote and dangerous locations in all the Astro Lab. The clean room. This Arctic wasteland has known to claim the lives of at least several cadets. I've got to prepare myself. I'm going in. Here we've managed to find a couple more locals. Let's ask them if they know anything about the creature. Gentlemen, do you know anything about Colonel Todd Nathaniel? Colonel Nathaniel? Yes. What's a Colonel Nathaniel? Oh, uh, now, Colonel Nathaniel is a, a, a mythical beast created by parents to keep children in bed at night. Uh, it, it originated in the Usafa culture. Um, we found evidence of this in the Yikyok. Uh, it's a strange database of, of all of their culture. It's a dark, terrible place. But it, it, it makes reference to this Colonel Nathaniel. Let's leave them to their religious uh, things. I think we're getting closer on the trail. Uh, oh, hey, let's talk to these two. Maybe they've seen a Colonel Nathaniel. Have either of you seen Colonel Todd Nathaniel? Honestly, I think the last known sighting was two and a half weeks ago. Oh, I thought he retired. Man. No, I really need to ha ask him questions though. Did he really retire? I don't know. Wait, I think I, I think I can hear him. He's over this way. We need to talk to him about what. Here we are. We're going into the very lair of the beast. Oh, oh, oh! He's he's coming out. Don't startle him. Don't startle him. This is amazing. An actual Colonel Nathaniel in his natural habitat. Wait, Colonel Nathaniel, I've been looking you... for you for like two weeks. I need two <laughs> seconds of your time. Really quick. So, sir, I know you're really We're actually you know, seeing them interact um, in nature. Okay. Can you walk to my car I, and I ask? All right, let's do that. Oh, it's my... There we have it. The Colonel Nathaniel in his natural habitat. He's now gone from a myth um, to a legend. We have the one thing necessary for it. Blurred video evidence. Payload um. change. All right, so we're going to be removing Canis fan from the thermal chamber. Hey, Courtney. 
Yeah. So I have some ideas for about, about these pizzas, right? Okay. So get this, get this. You know how pizza places sell wings? Uh huh. What if we took the wings and put them on the pizza? <laughs> Hear me out on this one. Spaghetti pizza. Like this one is gold though. Okay. You're gonna love this, ready? Right. Chicken tikka masala pizza. What if we just stick with sausage, pepperoni, and cheese? Yeah, you know, or 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 that. that, that. Six and a half hours later. Get this though, get this though. Pepperoni and anchovies and apples. Think about it. Apples though. Oh, uh, Major Captain. Uh, I mean, Captain Cap. I mean, uh, Brian. I mean. Uh <laughs> Um, so today I'm going to be talking to you about how I stuff in and about Falcon Sat 4. This is very official stuff. And so, don't, don't uh, take this stuff outside. Slide, slide please. Uh, so how I say, uh, we're going to put the artist rendition here. Uh, don't worry about that part yet. So once upon a time, we sat the satellite. We, uh, there was a neglected ground station. We had to fix it some sound off. Keep breathing. Louder. So, we had to go to the ground station and fix all the stuff to make it work. Uh, but, uh, 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 lock it up. Do it. He is One of the lessons learned from this is that communication. This is only a drill. I repeat, this is only a drill. Let's go. Any, any questions for my. Payload change. Falcon fam. Hey everyone, I'm not collecting tours anymore, so make sure you log those in your own spreadsheet. Also, we'll be in H2 next class. Looks good. 12 seconds later. Hey Courtney, here's my hours. It's lesson 32. Oh yeah, those are from November, but you can just backdate those, right? I don't Okay, think I thanks, can. bye. A few moments later. Hey, so Courtney. Um, quick tour update. So I did one yesterday, and I think it, that one was for my four degrees. But the one that I did last week was for my AOC's dog. And I think I did something like, I don't know, it was a couple months ago. So just like, can you make up a date? Just like slide it in there. Did you read my, I sent out an email. I'm not collecting tours anymore. You do emails? Later. Rehearsal starts in 15 minutes. I'll be right back. I'm going to grab the laptop from the lab. <laughs> Guys, we're in H2 today. Oh, oh, really? What? Really? What? How are we no. supposed to know that? I sent out an email a week uh, ago. Courtney doesn't send Yesterday emails. and then today as a reminder. What email? We put you in charge. <laughs> All right, we're ready to vibe King of Tuna. Just checking on that print. Oh yeah, the extra needs a little adjustment though. Just wait, 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 no! Do you wanna get some hours? Come on, let's give a tour. I don't know what you're nervous for. You've said it all before. Don't run out the door. We used to be productive, spending time in here. Oh, how the hours do fly. Do you want to get some hours? No, Dan! Okay, bye. Do you want to get some hours? We could be watching something friends. New payload is on the maker bot. It's really hot. Crap, it warped again. It gets a little lonely in this empty lab. That's cause it's 2 a.m. Do you want to get some hours? They don't have to be full hours. Yeah, they do. I'll be here.
bit of change. Not from Kansas. <laughs>